Over 7 million people die of cancer each year worldwide. It accounts for 13% of deaths globally. Besides the classic genetic alterations, a growing number of epigenetic alterations have become hallmarks of the disease. Cancer did. Going beyond genetics in the fight against cancer. In order to tackle cancer from this new angle, scientists worldwide are acknowledging that new research strategies are required. In January 2008, the Cancer Dip project emerged as the joint effort of leading European groups in the field of epigenetics to help define the epigenomic profile in a number of human cancers. The main goals of the study in Cancer Dip is the study of the DNA methylation pattern difference between normal and cancer cells, mainly in leukemia and colon cancer. In addition, we're also studying the mechanisms uh, are involved in the establishment of, of these DNA methylation marks in, in cancer cells. Defective DNA methylation patterns are not only characteristic of the disease, but can also be used as predictors of cancer behavior and of the response to treatment. In this context, the Cancer Dip project has validated a novel technology to detect and isolate the epigenetic modifications present in tumors. Methylated DNA capture by affinity purification. At the beginning of this project, we started with a technique that's called methyl DNA immunoprecipitation. It's a way that using antibody, you're able to fish out from the cancer cells which CPG sites undergo DNA methylation in cancer cells. And this has been now improved using a new technology that we call a methyl cap and also the DNA methylation microarrays. Another important twist of the story is that this can be used now from in different labs and different uh, users because this has also a possible commercialization using different SMEs. This new tool has been used to obtain epigenetic maps, which are the starting point for the identification of regions with aberrant methylation that can provide clues for understanding tumor pathways or could be useful markers in the clinic to identify cancer or to predict the behavior of the disease. One of the last results uh, derived from um, Cancer Deep is that we have obtained a DNA methylation fingerprint of more than uh, 1,600 human samples. The main results from this, that study is to see that every tumor type has its own profile of DNA methylation and that some of this profile can have a prognosis, for example, in the, in the prediction of, of metastasis. Very interestingly, also, we were able to see and to help in the diagnosis of what is called tumors of a non-primary. And in that regard, we think that some of this data can also reach a practical use in patients. The results of the program will generate different bioinformatics tools. The genomic location of DNA methylation characteristics of the DNA sequence and presence of multiple epigenetic modifications and epigenetic proteins will be used to generate software to predict the epigenetic status of genes. The Cancer Dip project has been funded with 3 million euros from the European Union for three years. In total, it has involved more than 20 molecular and cellular biologists, cancer experts and bioinformatics specialists from five different countries – Spain, Belgium, the Netherlands, Germany and Italy. The interest and research in epigenetics has increased in recent years. We must go beyond genetics in the fight against cancer.